Well, for most families, it's not the holidays without a picturesque pine, but this year many are opting for natural over artificial. So we sent our Nadia Galindo to a local tree farm to find out all you need to know to pick out that perfect tree and keep it alive through the holidays. Picking the perfect tree is really an annual tradition that's brought Liliana and Charles Giotti to Coburn Farm in Garrison. Every year we get a real tree. I don't like artificial, I like in natura. Where families can pick their own pine from a variety of in-ground and pre-cut premium trees. We grow all our trees from seedlings all the way up to 10, 12, 14 foot trees. Co-owner Sean Barton says his trees are grown throughout the state and in Pennsylvania. He says the key to a long lasting tree is ensuring it's freshly cut. So we're only cut a week out as to opposed to three to four weeks out. You may notice that some of the trees this year, well, they're a bit brown. That's because this year's crop took a huge hit caused by the drought. We tend to lose about 5% on a typical year. This year is more like 15 to 20% of trees just due to the fact of the drought. But there are still plenty of trees to pick and cart home. It's just the full family experience. Barton recommends feeding your tree plenty of water and a little something extra to ensure it makes it to Christmas. I always like to tell people also give a little Sprite or 7-Up. Um, that gives it a little boost. A trick of the trade to ensure your holiday includes a piece of nature at the center. In Garrison, Nadia Galindo, News 12. Right, or a 7-Up, I don't know about that. All right, for tips on how to preserve your Christmas tree, you can head to our website, news12.com, and all you artificial tree lovers, we have not forgotten about you. We've also got tips on how to decorate and spruce up those artificial trees. Head over to our Twitter page as well. Weigh in on which you prefer. Is it artificial or you want the real deal? Hmm, so which the... one is your favorite, Meredith, and what do you prefer? You know, I love the whole real tree experience, but it takes yeah. so much work yeah, that does. I almost kind of like the fake tree. Yeah. And then you put the little thing in there that smells like a real <laughs> Christmas tree. So they